of times on a baby horse like this, I'll go up to them and I want them to get the idea that everything's pretty cool. One of my best things I like to do is rub between their eyes, grab their forelock and rub their eyes and get them to understand that that's, that you're doing everything like I want. Um, to me, that's a vulnerable spot on a horse. It's right between his eyes. He can't see there as well, right, right in the middle. So they get to understand that that is, hey, I'm doing what he wants me to do. And over time, we build up on that. At first, he doesn't quite get it, and he's not going to understand it. So he'll move away. So, but over time, he understands that this is a move that, hey, you're doing everything I want. Also, what it does is when I walk up to him, and I have my hand up. I want to get him to where he doesn't worry about something coming at his head. It kind of desensitizes him to the fact that something's coming at him. Say if I'm up here, oh, bud, oh, and you know, and I'm moving my hands fast. I want to be able to put that bridle on, go here, go there, and I don't want him throwing his head up, hitting me in the head. So it's just another way of um, him getting used to me moving toward him. CPR for the Horse and Rider. If you have any questions, you can contact Tommy at TommyGarland.com.